so we know the term direct cremation, or I like to say simple cremation, is just that. The funeral home service that is being provided is just a cremation and filing of the death certificate. Sometimes they're going to place an obituary for you, help you write an obituary, place your cremated remains in an urn. You know, there may be other accessory items that they do assist you with, but the basic services is just that cremation. Same thing with the burial. There is a term called immediate burial. Why it's direct cremation and immediate burial and not direct for both or immediate for both, I'm not sure, but traditionally it is immediate burial. What that means is the deceased is typically not embalmed, not usually viewed. There is no service of any kind, not a graveside service. They go from the death place to the funeral home. They may be dressed. They're gonna go in a casket of some kind or a container of some kind, and they're gonna go for burial. It is not a scheduled service. It is not a scheduled graveside. Um, there's typically not family there usually. It is just that, it is an immediate burial. That is the type of service that is. These are gonna be listed independently on your general price list for a simple cremation or direct cremation and an immediate burial. These are things that FTC says we have to have an individual price because it is a reduced service fee. And it's reduced because we are doing less we are not meeting with the family as much. We're not scheduling a service with the family. So we are meeting, we're getting the basics for the death certificates. You may provide an obituary for the website. We schedule the funeral, or not the funeral, we schedule the burial, um, and we complete the burial. That's it, an immediate burial. So if you want to attend, then you're gonna have more fees because then it is an actual graveside service and it has to be scheduled around you rather than around the funeral home's schedule. So, immediate burial.